This is the Object 261. This is a Russian Tier 10 SPG. The map is Empire's Border. I'm working on two missions to cause damage 12 times by shooting and to stun three with a single shot twice, plus get 180 stun damage. Uh, I don't know if I'll be able to get either of those missions in this game. I think that a good position is to kind of play over here, but I'm going to wait and see what happens first before I run out, which I have learned the hard way. It looks like we've got good coverage over here. I think I'll be fine. Uh, so I'll probably take up a, a better position. Hopefully I'll be able to hit this guy. Obviously I'm parked in a decent location. There is a rock in front of me, which is going to give me a little bit of protection. And I was going to blind fire on the grill, but he is spotted, so I will obviously shoot at him. The key is to be able to see if I can... Ah, he stopped. To see if I can hit over here. Uh, that would be really nice. I do have to worry about enemy SPG, so I should move. There is an EBR, so I'm going to actually reverse... Hopefully I'll be able to aim into here. So I was able to get damage on three shots. Let's see if we could do something with this EBR. Uh, he's out of the game. But he did spot me, so I'm going to move close to this rock over here, which is going to protect me against the enemy SPG. I really don't want to blind fire if I don't have to. Come on, guys, spot something. Okay, so I think that they're going to come around. The enemy is really pushing us. So maybe staying here is the right thing to do. Alerting my ally to where I'm able to fire. I hope he understands that he's got to come back behind here. And I really got to hightail it out of here. Because that guy's certainly going to fall. I don't know where these other vehicles are, like the Progetto and that one there. I don't know if they uh, retreated or if they came to help. I don't know what their situation was because I wasn't paying attention. But it looks like everything's going to work out. Wow, I hit him for 274. I got five of the hits that I need. I don't think I'm going to get the three with one shot. And I really don't think I'm going to be able to do anything else over here. So we're going to, we're going to go after the mouse. This tank spins very quickly, but it's got a very n narrow gun arc. Let my ally know that I'm going to help him out over here. And I'm going to move closer to these rocks so that I'll be able to fire, but I don't want the enemy SPG to be able to shoot at me. And I want to be closer to that mouse so that my shots are more accurate. Once you get to 10 seconds, you really want to work on aiming. Let my ally know that I'm going to fire. You can see that he didn't really uh, take it seriously. He ran in and got close. He really should have stayed a little bit further away. I still want to get closer as long as the enemy's outside the white circle. Let my allies know. It does show that there's eight seconds left for my reload. So they do get a little bit of additional information. I missed my chance to fire. Okay, I'm going to pull over 
to the right a little bit in case I need to shoot around that rock. I hope I called this right. I might have, you know, I might have done it wrong. Maybe I meant to go to the left. Okay, so I made a mistake. I, I meant to go uh, towards this rock over here. That was a mistake. We, we don't know where that leopard is. That's a big deal. I got to help out my team with this mouse. We can pull it off. I knocked these trees down to give me some cover, but it might let the enemy know where I am. I'll blind fire here if I have to. Let's check out the leopard. Okay, I took the E100 out of the game. I'm within range of that mouse. Ah, he spotted me. I was trying to stay to the right so that the uh, trees would protect me. I am going to blind fire at the mouse. Got nine shots left. Uh, so someone was watching the leopard and noted that uh, he had fired, which means he was vulnerable. They're going to get that leopard. The question is, where is the mouse going? In a blind fire. I wish I had gone that way. Unfortunately, I didn't. If they are smart, they'll spot that mouse where I can hit them. But they might not do that. Keep on pulling back. Got to see what's behind me. I'll use this house in front of me to block. Come on, guys. Do something. Do something productive, guys. Okay, now I'm going to be able to move forward again. I want to help my team out, but I also want to cap. We won the game. Game says 1,600 damage, 1,900 stun, two kills. Let's see what the final results are. So it's a difficult map. And you definitely want to move around depending on where the enemy is. You need to have a faster tank. A fast tank would definitely make a difference. So uh, I do like to use the consumable, the fuel consumable. It'll give you a little bit more power going up the hill, for example. Didn't complete any missions. Uh, it says I did 1,600 damage. And... 1600 stun okay and remember don't use the manageable bonus for a tier 10 tank you won't get anything if you have any questions or comments please post below uh, don't forget to follow me on twitch and subscribe to my youtube channel